just men and women. Karikon kumi itano donka. Osovo lo gobe chitabiro chamisa. Eke joku jono. Na masomo mwegali. All the readings are in this magazine. Thank you. We can join the choirs, we clap. This is a joyful day. Oh, we can Jenja ye kulembiro mwa kaguno Mukama tuongero kukiriza Musengwa tuongero kukiriza Na mukonga yaka Obugalo, ah.
Bishop Chairman, Bishop Joseph Anthony Ziwa. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. The Lord be with you. My brothers and sisters, let us acknowledge our sins and so prepare ourselves to celebrate the sacred mysteries. I confess to Almighty God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Sing the Gloria, the Tamarosi Gafenaga Malay, Kanaba to Kiribo, who we image to watch Akatonda. We are going to remain standing and welcome the word of God, the word which the martyrs believed, that we too may welcome it in our hearts. Let us pray. O oh God, who have made the blood of martyrs the seed of Christians, mercifully grant that fertile and always yield you an abundant harvest. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity. Remain standing. Kingdom, the book of the gospel is brought in procession by Soga Kingdom, led by the Prime Minister. Chizingidwa, Kabonero, Akechigwa. It is in the shrine, the shape of the shrine, and here, and we become the shrine of the word of God. Let's go. 
Tugenda kukalira Tutule Ulire chikambo cha katonda Let us sit down And listen To the word of God The, the first reading is going to be read to us by a blind person, reading by Braille, Mr. Kajebe Kenneth from Bishop Willie's Co-op. But they are not true Jews. They are a group that belongs to Satan. Don't be afraid of what will happen. Our soul has been rescued like a bird from the fowler's snare. As a grain of mustard seed, you could say to this sycamine tree, be rooted up and be planted in the sea, and it would obey you. Mubudde buli, Yezu ya gamba ba igiri zwabe, ntiebye sitazo, tibire makubawo, na yali bireta zimusanze. Pichandi sinzo burunji Oyo kwe kusibibwa kubulago oruvengo asulibwe munyanja Aleme kuletera chesi tazo omu kubatobano Mekanye na chino Muganda o wakuzanga kumusango Mukomeko Awa watume neba gambo omukama Ntitu kukiriza Omukama na gamba Ntisinga Mubano kukiriza ya dokutono Ngempeke ya kalidari Mwandi gambie omutiguno obwenke nene Ntiwe sindule We simbe mnyanja Neguba ulira The Gospel of the Lord. Let us sit down. name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Lord, increase our faith. Lord, dear Namgongo Pilgrims 2023, the Diocese of Jinja, on behalf of Tororo Ecclesiastical Province, namely Kotido, Moroto, Soroti, Tororo and Jinja, the Orientals, 
as they are known, where traditionally wise men come from. Ente jawa yiswe ngo woye nalimu Jinja last animated this day in 2002 20 years ago We shall next appear only 2043 So Jinja Diocese, Busoga Subregion, be happy and proud animating this second mass. I'll invite all, all those from Jinja, stand up, smile a bit and wave the pilgrims. We pray one day Angelina Yakova Gururu Matia Bateganyov Namirali may join the line. Personally, it is indeed an honor and privilege for me, Charles Martin Wamika, Omala, Adieri, Omunabuka, Owena Mengo Budaka, Omuise Kisige, Oweb Soga. To be the main celebrant. The Universal Church today celebrates the mass of the Uganda Martyrs. And here on the spot where they were burnt, it is I, the main celebrant, for the first and maybe the last time. My parents, BK and MK, lost their first two boys in infancy. A certain Reverend Sister Martin, Martin, a teacher, advised mommy to name the next boy she may get after one of the martyrs. Born in 1953, she chose the martyr Caroli. And when the villagers teased her and with Caroli, she decided to add Martin, the advisor who advised her. And the midwife was Reverend Sister Dolorita, still alive. So 69 years of age, 44 years a priest, 29 years a bishop, through sick and thin, I stand on the ground where Charles Luanga, my patron saint, was burnt to death. Many of you also have patron saints, but some of you may not be sure where and how they met their death. For me, I know. We are here to arouse, to awaken, to inspire, to pray through the matters. Lord, increase our faith. You know what? 
religion, dini, is taught, can be crammed. But faith can only be caught. It is infectious. If you sit in the company of someone full of faith, you might catch it. We must be serious and infectious with our faith. What kind of faith? Faith in the Supreme God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, creator of an expanding universe, 100 billion galaxies. So far as we know, human life only on the third planet Earth of our solar system. That's the faith we need to have in that supreme being. Faith like what? Faith like of Abraham. Leave your country, sacrifice your only son, Isaac. Faith of Mary. How will it be? Let your will be done. Of Joseph. Instead of stoning pregnant Mary or divorcing her quietly, take Mary home as your wife. Peter, whatever you bind on earth will be bound in heaven. And after that, he denies him three times. The matter is Charles Luanga. Since you are intent on burning me, Pour water on the firewood so that the fire burns slowly. My brother, my sister, what faith do you take seriously? The number of hours you spend at the poker joint and the waragi joint or on your smartphone gives us a clue. Your faith is the lifeblood of the life of heaven. It is the victory over this world. It is eternal life. Catechism question two. Why did God create you and put you in the world? To know him, to love him, to serve him, and rejoice with him forever in heaven. We are here, but destined for heaven. How do we do the works of God? Believe in the one he has sent, Jesus Christ. But when Jesus begins to teach, love your enemies, do good to those who persecute you, pray for them, don't curse them. If you are slapped on one cheek, offer the other as well. Gospel of today, if he wrongs you seven times a day, and seven times comes back to you and says, I'm sorry, you must forgive him seven times. Even the apostles said, eh, if things are like that, Lord, increase our faith. I am the vine, you are the branches. Cut from me, you wither and dry up. Remain in me. You must be perfect, just as your Heavenly Father is perfect. But do we believe and trust Jesus with our lives enough? 1991, a youth, Emma, in Sacred Heart, Tororo, master to walk on a rope five feet high and ten feet long. And we wondered how this young man could walk balancing on that rope. An expert rope walker in America walked on a tight rope between two skyscrapers. Let us imagine from up there 
to that, that place there. So first time he walks across, then he walks backwards to prove himself. He walked the third time, people began admiring. And to prove he, he knew what he was doing, next he walked across balancing a wheelbarrow. People began to admire and say, ah, we now believe you. And then he told them, if you truly believe in me, get in the wheelbarrow and I take you across. What would your answer be? Ah, let me say goodbye to my family first. I know some of you. Ever heard of Kamiuka? A relative of Mukajanga, the chief executioner here. Kamiuka was in line with those who were working to be burnt. And Mukajanga, the relative, tells him to get out of line and escape. So the boy sneaked away and escaped. The story goes that during the canonization of St. Peter's Basilica, he was there in tears. Why? He missed to be burnt to be a saint. So sometimes when you dodge and you escape, you miss. Revelation 2.10 encourages us do not be afraid of the sufferings that are coming to you even if you have to die keep faithful and I will give you the crown of life for your prize second reading is Romans 5 3 to 5 Paul cautions and exalts let us exalt too in our hardships, understanding that hardships develop perseverance. Perseverance develops a tested character, something that gives hope, because the love of God has been poured in our hearts by the Holy Spirit which has been given to us. Inevitably, there will always be challenges and dissensions. How do we react to them? Albert Einstein, one of the great physicists, offers a guide. For the weak, they seek revenge. The strong, patronizingly, they say we shall forgive. The intelligent, the ignore. Do you take your faith seriously? Trouble is many Catholics are too shy. I can look around here and see. If you don't share your faith, it will slowly die and soon to be dead. Believe in yourself. 2003, we were in Palisa town to welcome the diocesan Golden Jubilee Cross. The parish priest, Reverend Father Silvio Koth, had told the Christians to gather at the parish. While we were in Palisa town, Lo and behold, as we wait, a catechist from one of the sub-centers, one of the outstations, appears with his delegation of about six people. On his shoulders was an improvised worn-out tablecloth for a humeral veil. With this, he held their outstation church crucifix of about three inches high above his head. Behind him were two Akogo boys with some tune. I think it was Yalamaso, Papa Yalamaso. 
A woman and a small boy followed making allegations. Guess what? The delegation was right in the middle of the road. From your sub-center with Tuakogo boys, one woman, one child, with the cross in the... I looked at him and I said, man, you are a bishop. If it was you, what would you do? I tell you that day, it dawned on me that for some Catholics, there is no shyness. For some Catholics, with faith, there is no joking. That went down on me and I learned, do small things in a great way. Do the obvious in a unique way. With faith, there is no joking. Everything else joke, jokes around, but faith is no joking. Brother Ernest Paquet taught us in differential mathematics. To commit something to memory, read it, no. See it with your eyes open. See it with your eyes closed. Articulate loudly with your mouth. Write it in the air with your finger in big letters. And act it out with your whole body. How do we say it from the heart? Can we say it in such a way that is infectious? Today, what are the matters telling us? Ever since Parisa, eh, that time when I told the translator to translate, because I didn't know the languages, that's when I heard Ateso, Koto Mayun Mama Polia. Some have heard, Koto Mayun. Mama Polia said, Wow, even the music has come in. Rumasava, Mufu Girila, Mpayo Sinayota. Father Mayamba is smiling. We went to Bukia, Kapchora, Kwaimani, Hakuna Muchezo. We came to Adola area. Iyeyo ongo yetuko. You can even turn it around. Ituko ongo yeyo. The Samia mufu giri la evulo mbayo. By the time we came to Busoga, my dear, awalo kuikiriza. Awalo kuikiriza. That was for the pilgrims. Let us also tell the neighborhood of Namgongo. Awalo kuikiriza. Lastly, let us also invite the saints and the martyrs up in heaven to come here so that people don't go back as they came. So they are a little bit changed. Awalo kuikiriza. The other languages I'm still learning. When you go to a restaurant, especially for us bachelors, uh, you need a doggy bag so that what you don't eat there, you take back home. Dear bishops and priests, we are the official and expert teachers of faith and how to get to heaven. When the tests come, don't do the exams for the students. The matters became matters when the priests then had taken cover in Tanzania. That's when they were brave enough to become matters. So if you over pamper your people there, they will never be matters. Today is a national holiday. We thank our government the Ministry of Tourism, 
Thank you for advertising and promoting the image of Uganda here and abroad. See how the Uganda Matters are also helping you in this cause. Thank you for helping them to help you to promote Uganda. You can see. Married life is a continuous struggle. You have to continuously look for new tricks. The old ones may not work for you. Saint Matia Mulumba first joined the Muslims, then the Protestants. When he started attending the Catechism of Ludell, he had four or five women, not too sure. On May 28th, he decided to join the Catholic Church. He was baptized, confirmed, and wedded as the first wedded couple in Uganda. So you Catholic men who are here, who have four women, who are giving you four years, drop one each year, so that at the end you wed one. Our religious men and women, anyway, you are already religious enough. I visited Lourdes some time back, and I learned from their brochure that they have more than 200 hotels or more than 200 beds. Some of those hotels were for the religious. Now you are poor, but when you get rich, also put some hotels for this people to begin being hosted here. The children, St. Christo has demonstrated your innocence. Even the Lord Jesus advised grown-ups, unless you become like children, you will not enter the kingdom of God. As you pray to pass exams, Pray for your parents also to get the school fees and square up their marriage. The Catholic pork vendors of Namugongo. Now that you have got all that holy money from the pilgrims, how about paying one eighth instead of one tenth for Ndobolo? The youth of today. You see more affected by modern life. Smartphone, internet. Empisa Nungi, good manners seem to have been thrown overboard. The majority of the Uganda matters were youth like you. When you grow old, how about creating a website? www.empisenungi.com Dear pilgrims, look around and take note. When you get back home, what is it you will share about the matters? May the Lord increase your faith so you get whatever you ask. Advises homilists, when you come to the end, stop and leave the faithful in peace. Onsumbayaniriza bonna balamazi mulinyali esaze kulu elie tororo era ne mulinyali esaza lie jinja e okutule etawano. Omusumba agambie ntiafunye omukisa ogwenja ulo Okukule embera echita ambilo cha misa Mchifo omutu kilivu omuolele zawe Weyaburu amu Kalori luanga Weyawela yo ovulamu we Enso ngaluachi tuli wano Kwe kuzu kusa No kusikiriza balala Okwe sigaba julizi 
no kweyambisa obuwolereza bwaabwe ekyo kitu yambe okukula mu kukiriza ngo mulamwa ogo tusanga mu bangu ne petero za ndifetu imide tutia mu kukiriza kwa fe okukiriza kwe kutusa mu bulamu obutagwao okukiriza kwe kuwangu zenseno okukiriza kutweta agisa okubaba gumu era abavumu mwebyo ebitusomoza okubaba kiriza abanna madala tulina okugabanyiza akabalala okukiriza kwa fe jana kunti abakatoli kibangi bali ne nsonyi we bituka kubiyeba kiriza bota gabanyiza balala kukiriza kuo kugenda kusebengerera era ne kufira dalala omusumba agambye nti byetu isemu obaye byayisemu bimulaze nti awali okukiriza tewaba muzanyo tewaba kusaga kunkomerero omusumba atujukiza obuvuna nyizibwa bwafe mu mbera za fe ezenja ulo eri abakrero asosoroti na basumba atulaze ntutino kuyigiriza eddini no bukugu oba father ludero mapera ne banne okuyigiriza aba kristu okuba abanywevu mu kukiriza kwawe yonna ebesanga ngafete tuliyo eri aba kulembeze abebyo bufuzi asi eri awe bwa bakiriza okusobola okusinza kuluna kuluno olwa bajulizi ba Uganda nokubassa mu ekitiibwa abafumbo ababuliride nti obulamu bwa kutetenkanya obudde bwonna ababuliride abulide abali mu nsonga okutwala ekyo kulabirako ekyamatiya mulumba eyeva mu naleka abachyala balala era nasigaza omu we yagatta na yempeta weve mu buli mwaka oteko omu okutusa luosigaza omuchalo omu gona siba na yempeta eri abana dini abasajja na abakazi atubulide twewale ekikemo ekyo kutwalirizibwa ABNC na dala mu nsanje zino abana abato abagambye nti mutwale kizito omuto nge ekyo kulabirako ate musabire abazadde bamwe okutuukiriza obulungi obunanyizibwa bwaabwe no kulongosa obufumbo bwaabwe abasubuzi abenna mugongo abafunye nnyo munaku zineza abajulizi temwera bila kuwayo ikimwe ke 10 abavubuka mwabali mu maso mukumanya ebya teknolojia muigire ku bajulizi abali abavubuka anga mmwe okumanya okumanya kwa mmwe kubayambe okututumula empise nnungi elya balamazi fenna afundi kidenga atugamba tuko ekyo kuyiga kitunaga banyizaako abo betwale seka tugenda okulira enjigiriza yo musumba mu lulimi oluswahili taifa la Mungu teule wa Kristo wapendwa Mungu ni mwema na kila wakati jukumu langu ni kutafsiri kwa mambo machache 
hotuba iliyotolewa na askofu askofu aliyotoa hotuba ni askofu wa jimbo la Jinja mwashamu Charles Martin Wamika baba askofu alianza na kutukumbusha kauli mbiu ya mwaka huu imetolewa kwenye injili ya mtakatifu Luka sura mbuzi mkatoliki hapa Uganda wanasema ngurue baba askofu aliendelea kwamba kwa uzoefu wetu kwa imani imetufikisha kwenye itimisho kuwa kwa imani askofu ameshauri amewashauri kwamba mujilinde didi ya jaribio la kupenda mali ya kupenda mali sana amewashauri kuepuka tamaa ya mali na anasa kwenu watoto baba skofu amewahimiza kwamba msomeni kupitia kwa mtakatifu kizito yeye ni mfano mfano wenu mwema wa kuigwa amewaambia kuwa mwaombeni wazazi wenu ili wawajibike kwa kuziweka ndoa zao sawa sawa wafanya biashara nao pia wamepata ujumbe wao hasa wale ambao weke wako kwenye mazingira ya namugongo mmefanya biashara nzuri na mmepata faida kubwa kwa ajili ya umati wa watu amewaambia kumbukeni kumrudishia Mungu zaka na fungu la kumi kwa vijana wa siku hizi baba skofu amesema kuwa mnaonekana kuwa mbele zaidi kwa teknolojia mkisoma kutoka kwa mashahidi waliokuwa vijana amewasihi kwamba mutumie mtandao kuendeleza maadili mema na kueneza injili hatimaye baba skofu amewashauri Obamber kare dishu adonga kwat ujolo we kweratin ne ujolo wo kun koni pen kopatin tieni road mediewa ogamo road mediewa en ujolo wa ya bila chilo cha denre o meyo ganda kun beru kada wa haduong ni jinja daisis enati atello eka jinja ametia tel ni enni kome dang tikira wa haduong ya na gokera chil oitia kinajwa moto kwena mekweri tia timere ye eno poyo we wani ginokelo wa kan uberu choyo ye wa mi yuleri ye wa keredok lego kuno bebot cha denre ma chil me uganda endang opoyo we wa Niti jo ameda unyuriyege e Bible ame wanna nyorlobge eno ko Abraham ame yawe globo mere eka te jallo wode dan eno ko yekere abon cho et kuno be ye men 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 no gamo keni wek time ko makita me ko bo eka ente ko bo Joseph Joseph ame uyeni yinya yichege cha 
pobero ticha ngatuke na eto bero ticho ba eka teko ba kwa kupita tetu nuke na kaboro cha denre mo wa kana metiru wantu kuero gini nigi nao unyuri yegi eka entepe nyo wani wan kono ye watie ningo uti uchungu na teke ye ye ea uberu gina uberu yo aluor yano kone wano tole polo wa uluor ye wa lewit maho wa ye wa chan kao binu borwa Orete oweke ye wako Eno koni miro Iko me ye Tukube da pe ye Iko me ye Tukube Miro chungu na tek ye wa Ente me de wod Kun kubi wani Wandu cha moti kani Uti kiri gini na me miro timu Uchao kiri wani padi Kiri bisope Niti chwa time ponyo jo Kuno ponyo gi mewe kari wando pe puru chungi na tek iye iye I karame chane, karame peho, kiri karame atema tema Uko wane joa wantinu wantu kweru gi kani Ubino ponyo gi Eka pwa dite ngwa ido kwa Tanzania Edo gino mpito chunga tek iye gi Eka uta wango gi pi iye gi Uko ni wana miyo tima mwana wana padi kiri bishop Eka boga mente upuwa wagi pigi na gino timu Kiri ngwa gino konyo akwa hako kweru tini Kere raba mut me kweri ilobolong omiyo kweri ngeye ngeye teping dushu. Bodyo unyomo kere yiyot ukoni kwa me yiyot titekere tiye luenchi yiye tema tema tiye yiye etu miyurpo jale unu. Uyenyi unu yiyo nyen metiye kupeha ametiye yiyot wek pebed kara pokwere keken ena yiyo bero agame peha ume yiyot. Eka tepo yupi Jomo jalo kuogi Mano Chesere do kede Kede chora Ni wana miro guwaka yu wana tema tema milim Amel Chao kene Miyo wawo yao kwe yuwa mopore Entu kunte kubini Kadang kare kare moro binu nungu nchente Uyubu gire hot Entu hoti piri yonge pepe dana chela chela Pi tino Teko ni tina wuna itikila nyut ya kina joa moti ni wantu kweri ni Mwa ulo eni kizito achil Kizito achil nubi la tina bala wun Entu wenda uchunyi ye mere Pien unge ungo wame ye obedo Teko bani wuni tina na mire kwa wuno pia unyualu Uwe gina uribere Gina unungja mame mite Piko nyuwe kwa anu kere kuo uwa loro Uko oboro chatwila me onu chuk Pibina joa ikweri Nige nanka utiyo limgi Gina ujal ginoro boto ba Uko wabot buli Ni wunde ingeo pinga karo doke kadikarni Chim tu chingu Internet tu chingu Computer tu chingu Wundo miyuti kere jamini Merabu yowa beri kita beri kere tama beri ya kina joa Uko wunu wenu duch Ni idoku wunu pashu kere ginoro Kwa nyo ginoro atitiri idoku wunu kere pashu Wake wuri nyuako wunu kere joa modong pashu Pe doki chini nono Eka ente kone oba meda mere kere Goyo tama ere kongu Ngoa wuni kwao Ame binu nkede Wake oba gamlegu wu Opuwa wuni Yesu Kristo We now listen to the translation In a brief From the Rinyoro Kitara language Eni niyo nyege saya itu Yo mlisa Umrulimi oru nyakitara Omutwe kwa itu Gumuaka gunu Ugwe kilo kinu Niguruga Omu Vanjiri ya luka Umikiri Umutwe kwa ikumina msanju Orukara ruakatanu Ngugamba Ngumukama Tuongere Okuikiriza Omlisa wa itu Atangiri hile ituena Awaramagi Hawa inyamasaza umweklezia katolika ya Tororo. Kandi na muno muno na tangira haruba joruisaza ya Jinja. Atuijukize ituena hangi gayo kuwa haitakalinu erirukwera. Na ambere abakai sovaitu abaya Uganda basesire esagama yavu. Habuisaza ya Jinja matia mulumba. Hamuna gonza gagonza Nibo bakaiso waitu enzarwa Omlisa waitu omurongi adieri Yaitu ijukia kandi aino muhimbo muingi 
mali habu kwebe mbele kionzira kine kia misa na mbele umhikiriwe karoli wanga ya ferire engi gaya itu enkuru muno etuleesere hanu nuko gara vshaka okuikiriza kwa itu nukuongera kukonyera abagenzi wa itu avandi kubanobu esigwa wukwese ngeleza ni baraba ombaka iso ba Uganda habu kusigikira hamutwe kwa itu ogwe kirokinu oguru gamba angu mkama tuongeru wukwikiriza ni tusabwa kugumia wukwikiriza kwa itu Tuina ebyo kuroraho vingi omubihandike ebyo kwele. Ebyavo abayolekiro kuikiriza okwa amani gamba nka isenkruitwe Abraham, Yosefo muikirire, Petero, Kandimali na abakaiso abayuganda. Lero weza na itwe tuwe kaguze ngo kuikiriza kwa itu kulinkaha. Okuikiriza kwa itu niye sagama yowomezi owomu iguru. Okuikiriza kwawe iwo muramagi alihanu nubo obusinguz oina munsi munu. Okuikiriza kwawe nubo obuomezi obutahuaho. Tuijuke gebutosa, ngo kuikiriza kwa itu ni kutusaba kuba wagumisiriza. Kukira munu omubuire obuokubonabona omunsi munu. Na habweki omwepiskopi na tukaguza. Okuikiriza kwa itu ni kumanyisa kwe. Rundi ntu kuzanisa, kuzanisa. Ekizivu, ekituine, awa kristu vaingi, ntu gira ensoni omkuikiriza kwa itu. Kakuba, iwe, otagabana hakuikiriza kwa we, ni kuija kufwa wangu. Habwebi, omulisa, ebi arozire, Umumiakaye yobuhereza na tugumiangu na ambire hali okuikiriza tiharoho mzano. Umunyegesaye yono umuipsikopi na atuijuchia. Umubitibia itu hakuechumitiriza habujunani zibabuwa itu. Hali abipsikopi na abasaseredoti bagenzibe na abegesa kandi nkabegesa wokuikiriza. Babe ni kiokurorahe kia Father Lodel ni ba na wagenzibe. Tukonyere awa kristu vaitu kukura na ukujura kristu na ambere tutali. Hali governmenti na basima abu kutuumuza hakirokinu ya kia wakai soba Uganda na ukuongera kubamanyisa ihanga liona. Hali abali omurueto Uruwa buswezi na waijuchi angu obuomezi buina emisaraba. Baitu mtunge amageza amashaka habu okuba agakara tiga kusobora kutuyamba. Kaiso matia murumba abe eki okurora ho na ambere tuli na ambere nyonyuena abali ombuswezi oburukwe. Akale kabakazi basatu ya gaitu anomu kazomu. Obu ya zoi ile kristu Na habweki omulisa na atuijucha Inyuena abasai jaba kristu Abaina abakazi vaingi Ngumuleke omukazo muomu buli mwaka Nuko na inywe Uma liire ni mutela nizibwa no muwenka Halaba nyadin Leka tuwege ndeleze Ekibi eki omukoijo Tugumire habiragano vya itu Ebitu watire Ebi obu nyadini Hali aba nabato Mwegele hali kizito kaiso omuto Musavire aba zairivanyo Bahikilizo obu junanisi wabu Kandi basemeze obu suwezi wabu Hali aba suvuzi aba nyakuli omu na mgongo Omu kikaro kinu Kuzigikira omu lingo mutuungira magoba maingi Mutewa kugarula ruhanga Ekimu eche ikumiche Hali ensi inganto Ni muzoka ni mkuatabu wangu Ebioma ebya kalimagezi Mwegere hawakaiso vaa Uganda Abakaba vali ensi inganto Mkozese ebyo biona Ebioma ebya kalimagezi Kwa ile mvangiri ya luka 
omuntu okwekumina omusanvu olunyiriri olwo kutanu kwiza obuyaka okwikiriza kwa ife no kuongera okwekubiriza tweyongera okusaba nga tubitamba dulizi ba Uganda nga tusinzira ku ngombo omwai ja tukobeire nti awali okwikiriza wazira muzano mu kwikiriza kwa ife tuli nibe tubonera ku mukitabe kitukuvu ngo mu mwataire Ibrahim Yosefu Petero ni Maria era na abadulizi ngaba na abali yanulwale abaife aba Uganda amazi yatubuze chibuzo yakoba ati bano bala go kwikiriza okunywevu aya ate ifebuti okwikiriza kwa ife kuliwa okwikiriza omwepiskopi atukobye nti okwikiriza kwetaga obugominkiriza na ilala mu bisera ebyo kugezesebwa ni mukubo na abona tutwala okwikiriza kwa ife nga ekintu ekikuru oba okwikiriza kwa ife kutugemye ensoni bwe tutagabaniza ku babandi okwikiriza kwa ife ekivamu nga kufa chova embera ya ife etulaga anti okwikiriza mukwikiriza wazira muzano era nexembayo omwayi wa ife atwidukiza tona twena obuvuna nizwa bwa ife abasodoti baka kensa mu byaidini nga father mapera naba minsa ni abandi atukubiriza tuyambo kuinikiza no kuyamba aba kristu banwerere mu kwikiriza nga basobola okutukiriza okwikiriza oko waire nga tuzirawo eri abakulembeza abaiwanga abasimye olwo kutugolu na kulu no ngolwo kuwumula okongera okusakanya no kudaguza onako olwa abadulizi aba Uganda eri abafumbo abakobye nti obulamu bwa kulefubana luberera na kwega era na kuyiya bukodi obiyaka kubanga buwonerera ku bukodi obukaire buyenzo okulema okukola nga buwoyire kutibuka akola ya tuwe choko na kwecha matia mlomba omu kristo ya soko kugaitibwa mokerezia ya Uganda yale kawa abakazi abasatu na gaitibwa no malala awoni asabire abasada ababuti abaka ali munsonga ngoli na abakazi bana emyaka jiriye na jolina buli mwaka sula ko mulala gole guna ajjo kutuka ngo sigaiza mulala osobola kutukuza obufumbo bwo abana idini abami na bachala abasabye nti mwegale chikemo echo kugwidubanira ebyenfuna echiriwo mu chasa kino abana abato abasabye motwale cho kubonera kuwecha kizito omuto nga mu babana abalunji atenga musabira abazerepe imwe bulido abaisuka abagala nabalenzi abasabye era yabakoba nti mutwale mu babo obuvunanizibwa na ilalanga mukozeso obulunji emiti mbagano na mayengo gaku nga mukume mpise nunji mujikozese nga muzimba obulamu obukalamu abasubulira mu kiketozo kino era kuitaka lino twena tuongeze muku okulago kusima nga tuiriza ku katonda abala mazi twena twena omwa omwa yife atukobient buli omwa abe ku nichaye gechikalamu mukulamaga oko omwa akaguno echo choyeze chikalamu chobo ileyo ogabanize ku bana ife abandi atwende isa amala magama makalamu agaidwire okwikiriza okwerere Now let us stand up and profess our faith. To imirire to atuloko kiriza.
Dear brothers and sisters, we have all gathered here to celebrate the mysteries of our redemption. Let us therefore ask Almighty God that the whole world may be watered from these springs of all blessing and life. Seminarian Kidombulu Ambrose from St. Gonzaga Minor Seminary is leading us in the prayer for church leaders in Latin. Oremus pro principibus ecclesiae, pape, episcopis, presbyteris, et omnibus qui catholicam fidem docent, ut sine timore verbum dei ad predicandum, spiritus sancto roborentum, Lord, hear us. The prayer for political in Lusoka is laid by Mr. Emmanuel Mudasi of the Men's Guild Council from Iganga Parish. Katsavira wakule mbeze waife ababi ufuzi. Katonda inebiona abalambe nga mumagezi ni mkusalau. Biba sazewo Bivenga mumoyo guzira mbukuya Ulokule itakula kulana Mubantu ni monsi Ngabagereza mubwe simbu Mumazima Ni mukulela Amazima Kubola mubantu Lord hear us Prayer for the needy in Ateso is led by Mrs. Grace Okanya, member of the elder from Namirali Parish. Kelipata kanu kitunga kangulu hipudasi aoko agangata akwapukere. Itunga ngulu lu emuro kitai toma akwapin. Itunga ngulu lu emuangitai. Itunga ngunu lu etubono kino imusangono atitai. Itunga ngunu numame jenasi choti. Itunga ngunu numam eina kitai angosibibi. Iko kyoku. Itunga ngunu nwenye kintai ati itai. Itunga nwenye intai toma aitichanio. Lord, pray for us. Prayer for vocations is read in French by Sister Monica Natukunda of the Little Sisters of St. Francis of Assisi, representing the Council for the Religious. Lord, 
que le Seigneur suscite des serviteurs de l'Évangile, sans frères, sœurs, diacres et prêtres, qui, inspirés par les témoignages des martyrs de l'Ouganda, opèrent un don de soi total dédié au service du peuple et de Dieu. Seigneur, nous te prions. Lord, hear us. The prayer for the worshiping community, ourselves, is laid in Luganda by Maria Laka from Bugembe Parish representing the Council for Children. Fefe na abeta bie mshtambilo shino eshtuku vunga tukuza ona kuraba juizi ba Uganda tubalabile ko mkunyele la mkukiriza tusobole okubela abagobele ziba yezu abalunji musimuno no kukiriza, kulabikile, no kukiriza kwa fe kulabikile mubigambo ate ne mbikorabia fe. Lord, hear us. Prayer for the faithful departed is led by Honorable Chinto Brandon Alex from Kagoma Parish, representing the Council for the Youth. Let us pray for all our dead relatives and friends whose faith was known to you alone. In that company with Christ who died and now lives, may they rejoice in your kingdom where all tears are wiped away. Lord, hear us. Let us pray. May your mercy we beseech your Lord be with your people who cry to you, so that what they seek at your prompting, they may obtain by your generosity. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Katutuleko, let us sit down. <clears throat> Abagenda okutukunganyiza ebirabo beba easy abajinja college nebudini secondary school those who will collect the offertory gifts are students from jinja college and nebudini secondary school Again, the Kulete Virabo procession, but Aniki Okwete Kateka. The offertory gifts will be brought by 20 couples from Ginger Diocese, as well as some other people representing pilgrims. Please already stand in line.
the priests who will distribute Holy Communion. You are kindly asked already to take position around the, the sanctuary, stand around and already prepare, get the, the Siboria and stand around the sanctuary, please. The collection is still going on, of toy collection still going on. The gifts to be brought in the procession. It's the wedded couples asked to cancel from the dice of ginger leading. For offer to a collection, it's the students of Ginger College. Bodin is near secondary and the staff of Brighton Junior School and they're all putting on school uniforms. Operate every hour quiet, every hour, our fumbo, Okuva Sazari Ginger, we are going to play them. We have it at Kubakomongalo. Wanabali takuwa utali na hivyo liya wavuka kwa bachata ambla na wawala Started, please. The procession is starting, start moving forward, please. Move a little faster, procession, please. The collection continues even as the procession goes on. The media crew 
Oh, please, you give space for the main celebrant. Media crew. Let us rise and they present our gifts to the altar of the Lord. Let us all rise. Fenatu Yimidere. Tibetakwautari and also some representatives from outside Uganda from Kenya, from Tanzania, from Rwanda, from Burundi, from Nigeria. They are part of the team that's bringing the offertory gifts to the old. To Kulembeduamo, Abafumbo, the Wedded Kapos, from the Dice of Ginger, and also some representatives from outside Ginger. And we have representatives from Kenya, from Tanzania, from Rwanda, from Burundi, from Nigeria. Mukube nga bwanga lona muzira byonka The wedding couples have been joined by other people so team from outside Uganda as they offer their gifts to the Lord in thanksgiving from Tanzania from Kenya from Rwanda from Burundi from Nigeria from DRC from Malawi, from Zambia, and from Zimbabwe. Yes, we got to thank the Lord. To come and just to come and go Gatula Goxima Cafe. We also have representatives who have joined in the offertor procession from the Republic of Southern Sudan. From the Republic of Southern Sudan, our neighbors in the north. From Tanzania. From Kenya. From Rwanda, from Burundi, from Malawi, from Nigeria, from Zimbabwe, from DRC. Aboruganda, Uganda, Mukama, Tulagega, Tulagega, Tsimanga, Tukuba, Mungalo. Yes, we continue to thank the Lord. We are the procession of souls being joined by representatives from the Republic of South Africa. And also we have an ordinary from here, from South Africa, who is here with us. Choir, we continue.
my brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. We offer you sacrifice, O Lord, humbly praying that as you granted the blessed martyrs grace to die rather than sin, so you may bring us to minister at your altar in dedication to you alone, through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. Amen. Lift up your hearts. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere to give you thanks. Sing a new song in adoration, and we with all the host of angels cry out and without end we acclaim.
You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy therefore these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dew fall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and giving thanks broke it and gave it to his disciples saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. Laudate Dominium Omnisciente, Laudate Eum Omnis Populi. as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread to our world and bring her to the fullness of charity together with Francis, our Pope, and Paul, our Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the blessed Mary, Mother of God, with the blessed Joseph, her spouse, with the blessed apostles, the Uganda martyrs, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be heirs to eternal life, and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him, and with him, and in him, O God Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. At the Savior's command, and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, And forgive us our trespasses, 
as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity, in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Prince of Ginger Diocese, you are asked to go to the Basilica. You will help with the communion with the people around the Basilica. So you move now. Behold the Lamb of God, behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I'm not worthy that you don't under my roof, but only set the world and my soul shall be healed. May the body and blood of Christ keep us safe for eternal life. This is the time to receive the Lord in communion. 
why the Lord ardently desires that we receive him in communion and while none of us deserves the privilege at the same time the Lord requires we come with an appropriate wedding garment Catholics who are well disposed to are invited to receive communion Omukama ayagala fena tumufune ate kino ekiva kukusani la kwa fe wabula kukisache na era twagaza kusembera ku lujuliro lwe ne chambalo echembaga echisani de kwe kukiriza obaba katuliki atabe tegese the priests who give out communion will take the rest of the Lord to the Basilica after distribution. Those who are going to the Basilica, please from Ginger Diocese, you find the rector of the Basilica prepared for you in the Basilica itself. Yes, yes. 
Okay, they do.
Let us stand, please. We will be Let us pray. We have received this divine sacrament, O oh Lord, as we celebrate the victory of your holy martyrs. May what helped them to endure torment, we pray, make us in face of trials, steadfast in faith and in charity. We ask this through Christ our Lord. The next thing we are going to dedicate ourselves to Our Lady, singing Ave Maria, and the main celebrant request those who, those who have your rosaries, Hold them in your hands and wave them as we dedicate ourselves to our mother, Mary. Genda, okwesa mikono janyafe, tuimba Ave Maria, vaina sapuliza mwe, musabidwa muzikwate, tulage okukiriza kwa fe, munyafe atulera natutusa eomwana wa Yesu Christo. Uh, so dear brothers and sisters, for the people of Jinja, we gave out rosaries from the martyr's place here. As we started last year on Christ the King, we announced the year of the Uganda martyrs, and we blessed the cross which led us to this place. And wherever we have been, we have been blessing that cross and also a statue of our mother Mary praying that she guides us and she leads us. So this moment we are going to ask all of you who have their rosaries nearby. Uh, we want that you, we say thank you to Mother Mary and all ask, we ask her to bless your rosary so that when you go back, you go back with the blessings of the Mother Mary of Namgongo. <laughs> Not your small one down there. Yes, so the, the choir will lead us I need immaculate Mary. And as we said, uh, when we come to Ave, you raise your rosary towards the statue of our Mother Mary. The, uh, if Mother Mary is too small here, think of the one in heaven. You raise that one there.
Kubonga tumaze okufuna omukiso gwa nyafe nga tumaze okumweta okumwe okuhesa mikono je akati twaombe ke tufune omukiso gumaliriza let us place ourselves in humility to receive the final blessing let us humble ourselves and pray for god's blessing May the God of all consolation order your days in peace and grant you the gifts of his blessing. Amen. May he free you always from every distress and confirm your hearts in his love. Amen. So that on this life's journey, you may be effective in good works, reaching the gifts of hope, faith, and charity, and may come happily to eternal life. And may the blessing of Thank you very much, my Lord Bishop. Thank you very much. Since our last celebration here last year, a lot has happened. I invite you to remember our three bishops that have passed on since we were last here. Right Reverend Martin Ruruga, Right Reverend Erasmus Desiderius Wandera, Bishop Emeritus of Soroti, and Right Reverend Albert Edward Baharagate, Bishop Emeritus of Hoima. Let us observe a moment of silence in their honor. Eternal rest grant unto them, O oh Lord. They happen not in the same year and ordination of Right Reverend Dominic <laughs> and recently the very Reverend Lawrence Mukasa has been appointed Bishop of Kasana Ruero. We pray for this. This gathering is by far the biggest gathering annually in this country. What does that mean? It means that we, we give great to our matters. How I wish that the spirit that brings us here every year and guides us throughout would to do our part. In our everyday life, think about the Uganda matters. And there are many. When we waver and we feel weak, think of the Uganda matters. They gave us a very good example. And the Bishop said, Bishop Wamika said, that you know faith is contagious, meaning that we get it from the people around us, the people we dine with the people we work with, the people we live with, there are always very many good examples. The kind of people Pope Francis called the saint next door in his encyclical, the joy, no, the encyclical, rejoice and be glad. So are you going to be that example? every one of us. Dear pilgrims, I've decided to make my message that brief. Allow me to introduce some of the national leaders that we have for the laity. All of us in the association 
Uganda National Catholic Council reminds all of us, all the day faithful in Uganda. Our Vice President is Mr. Anthony Matega. As you can see the way he's dressed, he's a paper knight, and uh, Bishop Sekamanya taught me that the translation in Uganda is Omkungu wa Papa. Omkungu wa Papa, Simusirikale. That's what Bishop Sekamanya taught me. He's the chairman of the Central Organizing Committee for this year's celebration. A bigger hand clap. I want to introduce Mrs. Emily Mwaka, Soroti Diocese, John Margaret, Mr. Sam Okaba, Nebi Diocese. I hope I've not left out anyone who is here. I assume some are in there, but I know that Mr. Peter Leon from Marua was around. I believe there are others. Last but not least, allow me to introduce my wife, Rose Ndianabo. <laughs> Fellow pilgrims, we all came with intentions. May all our prayers be heard through the intercession of the Uganda Matters and Mother Mary, the Queen of Matters. Everyone say, Amen. 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 I will take this honor and privilege to invite the Archbishop of Kampala, His Grace Paul Semogere, who is also the chairman of the Lay Apostolate Commission of the Uganda Episcopal Conference, to come and address us. Your Grace, you are most welcome. Right Honorable Nabanja, the Prime Minister, dear fellow pilgrims from near and far, I welcome you to Namugongo to celebrate our faith on this feast of the Uganda Matters. My cordial welcome to you, the Papa Nuncio to Uganda. Your Excellency Archbishop Luigi Bianco. I also well, warmly welcome Archbishop Augustine Kasuja. Dear Bishops, dear Bishop Charles Martin Wamika, Bishop of Jinja, the diocese which has animated us this year, together with all the clergy, religious, and people of God of your diocese. We thank you for leading us so well in this year's celebrations. <laughs> to you, the chairman of the Uganda Episcopal Conference, Bishop Joseph Anthony Zua, together with all my brother bishops, especially bishops, pilgrims from other countries, who are here. My most cordial welcome to, the, to you to this year's pilgrimage. 
dear our distinguished pilgrims from the central government of Uganda and from other countries, I warmly welcome you all. I cannot forget to heartily welcome pilgrims from the Kingdom of Buganda, which institution bears a special historical significance to today's celebrations. The theme of this year's celebration, Lord, increase our faith from the Gospel of Luke, chapter 17, rightfully fits one of our basic needs as followers of Christ today. To grow more in faith after the example of the Uganda matters. It was because of their faith that we today recall with gratitude their sacrifice, whose witness of love for Christ and his church has now spread worldwide. This miraculous event was inspired and animated by the Holy Spirit, who unites us all as believers and members of the church. The Holy Father, Pope Francis, expressed it so well in his homily here at Namugongo during his pastoral visit to Uganda in 2015. 2015. Quote, what can we say of Saints Joseph Mukasa and Charles Wanga, who after being catechized by others, wanted to pass on the gift they had received? They did this in dangerous times, not only were their lives threatened, but so too were the lives of the younger boys under their care. Because they had tended to their faith and deepened their love of God, they were fearless in bringing Christ to others, even at the cost of their lives. So dear fellow pilgrims, we are always overwhelmed by the faith of many of you traveling hundreds, if not thousands of miles, adults and children, joyfully praying in songs and most often on empty stomachs and a danger of accidents and death. Thank you for honoring this legacy of the Uganda Matters faith. This is a witness not served by an occasional remembrance or being enshrined in the museum as a precious jewel. Rather, we honor them and all the saints when we carry on this witness to Christ in our daily lives. It is through such witness that we gradually discover that fidelity to God honesty, integrity of life, and genuine concern for the good of others brings us that peace which the world cannot give. The Uganda matters have impacted the world in many ways, even in matters of education. The Uganda Episcopal Conference shows to establish a university, Uganda Matters University, by carrying the name Uganda Matters that trains leaders with values and people that are of service to our church and to our country. Thank you for witnessing your faith. Dear pilgrims, the Uganda matters have impacted the world on matters of education, 
and that's the reason the conference elected a university after the Uganda Matters to train leaders with values that serve the church and the world in virtue and wisdom. Our Uganda Matters University was officially launched on the 18th of October 1993 as a commemoration of the day when the Uganda Matters were collectively beatified by Pope ben Benedict XV in 1920 and canonized by Pope Paul VI on the 18th of October 1964. This year, on the 18th of October, the university will be celebrating her 30th anniversary at the main campus of Onkoz and is preparing a grand celebration of the 60th, 60th anniversary of the canonization of the Uganda Matters next year. This university received a charter on the 2nd of April 2005, and it has developed into a reputable institution locally, regionally, and globally with over 30,000 alumni impacting society worldwide. Therefore, on such an occasion, when we commemorate the Uganda Matters, I urge you fellow believers, parents and students, to support and join Uganda Matters University for quality education that is grounded on Catholic values and the virtues of Uganda matters. Once again, I thank the animating bishop and diocese, Bishop Charles Martin Wamika. Thank you so much for leading us. We thank the choir that has animated the liturgy so well. We thank so much the Uganda Episcopal Conference for the role of guidance and value given to such celebrations. We also move a vote of thanks to our government for the continued support towards the development of Namugongo Shrine. Thank you so much. The rector and the Namugongo community, we are also so grateful for the custodian role played at the holy place. And gratitude to, to pilgrims from other countries. We thank the delegates from Tanzania who committed to cleaning up this holy place every after Uganda Matters celebrations. Thank you very much for the commitment. May you be blessed abundantly. As we go back home, let us continue to ask the Lord to keep our faith awake. Just as St. Paul exalts us, Stay awake, stand firm in your faith, be brave, be strong, as we read in 1 Corinthians chapter 16, verses 13, 3, 13 to 14. Yes, we must stand awake and firm against new ideologies contrary to our Christian faith. Awake and firm to promote the human dignity at all levels and above all to constantly renew our love for God after the example of the Uganda Matters. May Mother Mary, Queen of the Matters and Mother of the Church to continue to pray for us. May the Uganda Matters intercede for us.
Basebo ne banyabo Njagalo kufunza Nga nyanirizwa bakuru bonaba liwano Nyanirizwa omukuru Achikiride Igwanga Ngo mge nyo omukuru kumukoro guno Right honorable Nabanja Prime Minister Naba kungu awalabo na abaze Nyaniriza Saba Sumba Luigi by Bianco Nyaniriza Saba Sumba awalabo na batuweka se mkoro kuno Nyaniriza Chamano Foruchiko Musumba Joseph Anthony Ziwa Naba Sumba awalala Saba President wa Fuwaunkula Mr. Andia Nabo Noruchiko luo Nyaniriza wala mazo kufam government ya Uganda Abafude mwiseze nja ulo Abala abany, ab, ab, Abala mazi abafude Mwenju Mwewa Mwaka baka buka Uganda Ngo mwramu wakwe tukuja kuliza weguli Ntumuka ma tuongere wakukiriza Tusabu muka matuongere wukukiriza Nga wajudizi wa Uganda abo Abawayo, abawayo bulamu wabwe Ukubela kristu Nemu julida muku wakala na uvu zira Bala maziba nange mwena Ukiriza kwe mulina Kwe uinsa Antibanji mumwe Mutambala mairo nyingi nyo Ukutuka wano Hale na mujanga mujimba Nga musa akanya Nga mwega ili dani sanyu Awakuru na wato Olusi nga musi iba nenjala Mewa denyo kujuri la kristu Nga mula wira kubajuri ziba Uganda Okukirizoku Mwangiro kukuku umaburi jo Mubudamu wa fe Nyogede ku Uganda Matters University Tujiju mbire Awaso mbawaji teka wo Aina mwena muji wakira Eso so waze Mpise nungi Nengu njure nkatolichi Mugwanga Ewe nkristu mugwanga Tusabule okubunensi Nobutufu Tuwagire university ya fe Kubanga ya fe Nyongere ukwe baze sazari ya jinja Awamu ni bishop Charles Wamika Atukule mbede bulu unchi Tue waza kwaya Katonda wafetu mwe waza Atuwa dobudo bulu unchi Obutu sobo sizo kweka yudo bulu unchi Tusi imanyo Uruchiko rawa sumba Abe kerezia ya Uganda Okula ambika no kuwabula mumbera zona Tusima government of wakisi no kuyambi weko la mkutabiliza No kula ongoze chifo cha chifo chine chava julizi Sebo ule kitawe chifo father rubega Wamune na mgongo komente yona Mwewa lukukuma no kula wile chifo chino Abada maziba fe ya bafe Tanzania Tebadi layo weba maroku wega ilira Basi gara wano Nebeda mulika zambi yena Kutu sude mchifo chino Nebachile kanga chinyi lila Mweba lecho kula wadake chulu unjecho Tweba za katonda Okuva ndowoza Retwa ina Ebi zizo Ebi uruade wa COVID-19 Lero tulamaze banji nyo Omuka magude wo Aena mwene mukiriza ni muja banji Ni muju za na murondo Ni hibi febi enja ule vitukufu Hibi ya wajudizi wano mukampala Tutuwa aniriza Mweba lenyo Nika tunatumweba za Yeratu musaba Ayungero kuma Embele eno Enunji Eyobulamu Ngae yungera maso Tuungero kwa ya kalila mkutendeleza Nukusinza katonda Ngawe kisani de Fena tuangere kusawa muka matumyeze mkukiriza Elatu tase kumize ejulumbie okukiriza kwa fenensio na Tusababa julizi wa Uganda Batuwole rezebuli jo 
nga nyafi bikira maria nina wawajirizi ya tuwembeja mbaga rizoruge nurunji mtu shokudeka umuka maa abede na mwe thank you so much your grace ladies and gentlemen with us I would like to welcome His Royal Highness the Chaba Zinga of Busoga, Wilbur Force Kadumbula Nadiope Gabula Owokuna, Tukubenga Lunomusira, Ebiyama Nyeno, Chaba Zinga, Wabusoga, Adi Muchifochino, Akasirabe Kanatuka, Aidi Rokubanga Abanabe, Nabari Kurembera, Fe Tukwani Riza. My Lord Bishop, this is your day. This is your year. I feel that I'm very small. Uh, so dear brothers and sisters, I've been asked to say a word. I already preached. I don't want again to bore you. That's why I'm here just to summarize and say a sincere thank you to all of you for being present. Uh, the Episcopal Conference, we chose Eastern Province. The bishops chose Ginger. And it was like, wow, I don't know, I don't know. I also came and mentioned it in Ginger. And it was like a climbing a mountain. And a few times I remember some parishes. I had to go around, the, even myself had practiced Tafeni for Namagongo, Tafeni for Namagongo, Tafeni for Namagongo, Tafeni for Namagongo. So I'm happy that we are where we are today. Uh, the people of Ginger, thank you for responding. As I was telling some of you, you are used to be alone one bishop. Here you have had a mass with 20, 30 bishops. You have used to about 50 priests. Here there are over, I don't know, 200 priests. So this mass is not the usual mass you, you joke joke with us in Ginger. This was a special mass for you. So we are going back to our different places. We wish you a safe journey. We are grateful for all the contributions the individuals, the government, uh, the companies that we have reached where we are. The people of Jinja, uh, maybe stand up and wave the people to say goodbye to them as you go back or whatever. I still there are some of them. Aha, uh -huh, there you are, people of Jinja. Yes. Uh, we came led by the cross. And we have left it, I have donating it to Namugongo. But we are also praying and hoping that we go back with the spirit of the martyrs to Jinja. I've already talked to the deans, and I'm suggesting to them that the new parishes who are dreaming of starting at two or three should be named after Uganda Martyrs Parish so that we remember when we led here. Also, I told you, when my mother chose Karodi for me, the villagers looked a bit shocked, surprised, because they didn't know about Karoli. So I'm also deciding that in Jinja we start a Uganda Martyrs Hospital, that some children who are born there, they get the names of the martyrs a bit easier than instead of doubting, not knowing the Uganda Martyrs. So we hope slowly, slowly, it will catch on that also the spirit of the martyrs also come across the bridge to Jinja. That's our dream and prayer stemming from the animation of the mass here of the martyrs. But otherwise, to all of you, thank you for being present. Thank you for praying for us. Like I said, this is very long. And if I enumerate everything, I will just tire you and bore you. But we are grateful to all of you. From the smallest, uh, the children were asking for 1,000. 
the women 2,000, the government gave their contribution. We are grateful. They have helped us to be we are. So now I wish you a safe journey as you go back to wherever you came from. I now invite our chairman of the conference to come and also say what to you before we go. Chairman, you are welcome. The Right Honorable Prime Minister of the Republic of Uganda, Your Excellency, the Nuncio to Uganda, my dear brother bishops, the head of the laity, my dear brothers and sisters, and all protocol observed. I fall in the line of those who have spoken before me to say that we congratulate Ginger Diocese upon this successful animation of this year's Matters Day celebration here at Namugongo. The diocese chose the theme, Lord, increase our faith, which was taken from the request put to Jesus by his disciples after he had instructed them on exemplary life and untiring forgiveness. The Martyrs of Uganda chose the ultimate testimony, service, and witness through martyrdom, which was made possible because of their faith in God and Jesus, their Savior. Like Jesus on the cross, they forgave their tormentors and surrendered to God's will. Dear pilgrims from near and far, we believe that you have come to this holy place to celebrate the faith of the Uganda martyrs and are ready to allow Christ to increase your faith. Indeed, ask him to increase your faith. Seek him when he can still be found and call him when he is still near. As the prophet Isaiah told us in chapter 55, verse 6. I take this occasion once again to cite out some issues. I begin with the very good news that we have already known. I would like to announce once again that our Catholic television, the Uganda Catholic television, has been launched this morning, as you saw, at the beginning of the Mass, and the whole Eucharistic celebration has been covered live. This television channel will be used as an instrument for evangelization in the spirit of the Uganda Matters. Secondly, I would like to convey our condolences to His Excellency, the President of the Republic of Uganda, him as the Commander-in-Chief of the Uganda People's Defense Forces, on the death of Uganda soldiers who were 
recently killed in Somalia. Condolences go to all members of the families of the fallen men. We pray that peace be in the Horn of Africa, Sudan, and the other parts of the world, like Ukraine and Russia. Another issue that I would like to bring to at attention with the concern is that of recent, there have been brutal killings or murders here within Uganda, within the country. Several people have been murdered and quite a number of them have been killed by their killers using guns. It is our request to government and to the commander-in-chief to have stricter measures imposed on the use of guns in this country for both the security agents and private owners of guns. Here after, after this celebration, members of the Uganda Episcopal Conference, that the bishops from Uganda, will proceed to Zambia for our June annual plenary. We call upon you to pray for us so that we may have a successful plenary. As I conclude, I would like to introduce to you the bishops here present. I begin with His Excellency, Archbishop Luigi Bianco, the Apostolic Nuncio to Uganda. Then Archbishop Augustine Kasuja, Nuncio Emeritus, are living here in Uganda. And the following, I represent them according to our ecclesiastical provinces. His Grace, John Baptist Odama, the Archbishop of Gulu. <laughs> Bishop Sanctus Lino Wanok, Bishop of Lida, who is also the Vice Chairman of the Uganda Episcopal Conference. Right Reverend Giuseppe Franzelli, Bishop Emeritus of Lila Diocese. Right Reverend Raphael Wokorach, Bishop of the of Nebi. Kampala Ecclesiastical Province, here present is His Grace Paul Semogere, Archbishop of Kampala. Right Reverend Christopher Kakosa, Bishop of Lugazi. Right Reverend Severus Jumba, Bishop of Masaka. Right Reverend Matthias Sekamanya, Bishop Emeritus of Lugazi. Monsignor Francis Mpanga, Diocesan Administrator of Casanaruero Diocese. I go to Mbarara Ecclesiastical Province, His Grace Lambert Bainom Gisha, Archbishop of Mbarara. Right Reverend Robert Muhira, Bishop of Fort Porto. Right Reverend Joseph Sa Sabiti Mugenyi, Auxiliary Bishop of Fort Porto. Right Reverend Francis Aquilinus Chivira, Bishop of Kasese. Right Reverend Egidio Nkajanabo, Bishop Emeritus of Kasese. Tororo Ecclesiastical Province. Right Reverend Damiano Giuseppe, Bishop of Moroto. Of course, our main celebrant, Right Reverend Charles Martin Wamika, Bishop of Ujinja. 
Right Reverend Joseph Echiru Oriach, Bishop of Soroti. Right Reverend Dominic Eibu, Bishop of Kotido. Uh, some of the bishops have, who have been represented by their vicars general, uh, the vicars general we have here include uh, Monsignor Christopher M. Set, uh, vicar general of Tororo, Monsignor John Vianney Sunday, vicar general of Kabare, and uh, Monsignor Robert Mugisha, vicar general of Hoima. To conclude that list is the speaker, um, Bishop Joseph Anton Ziwa, Bishop of Chindamitiana, and Chairman of the Uganda Episcopal Conference. We have some visiting bishops. We have Right Reverend Yoao Rodriguez, Bishop of South Africa. Right Reverend Montfort Sitima, Bishop of Mangochi in Malawi. And Monsignor Molefi Romosei from the Archdiocese Maseru of Resoto. So, dear brothers and sisters, may the God of our Lord Jesus Christ, through the intercession of the Uganda Martyrs, and our mother Mary grant you peace and many blessings in your lives as you travel back home and may that peace and love remain with you always. Amen. May I take the honor to invite the Apostolic Nuncio to Uganda, Archbishop Luigi Bianco, to address the congregation. Dear brothers and sisters in Christ, I am happy to greet all of you, the distinguished civil authorities, the Honorable Prime Minister of the Republic of Uganda, the archbishops and bishops present, the clergy, the religious women and men, and all the faithful. As apostolic nuncio, representative of His Holiness Pope Francis to Uganda. It is an honor and pleasure to greet all of you and to transmit his apostolic blessing as pledge of abundant divine graces to all the participants in the celebration of the Uganda Martyrs Day. The history of the Church is also the history of the martyrs, starting from the first martyr, the deacon Stephen in Jerusalem. Also, the very beginning of the Christian faith in Uganda is blessed by the blood of the martyrs. The martyrs and all the saints are models and intercessors for the whole people of God. The team chosen for this year is Lord, increase our faith. This celebration is a special occasion to confess our faith in the Lord Jesus Christ and to grow, to grow in the same faith. St. Paul remembers that no one can say Jesus is Lord, except by the Holy Spirit. Faith calls for action in the big and small decisions of the daily life, and in this way to guide and inspire the Christians. 
the letters, the letter of, of James warns as a body without spirit is dead, so is faith without deeds. The Uganda martyrs put in practice the program that Jesus announced in his programmatic sermon, the Beatitudes. Blessed are you when people abuse you and persecute you and speak all kinds of calumny against you falsely on my account. Rejoice and be glad, for your reward will be great in heaven. This is how they persecuted the prophets before you. The Spirit gave strength to the martyrs in their troubles. Remain always valid the words of Pope St. Paul VI, who visited and consecrated the altar of the shrine of Namugongo in 1969. Modern man listen more willingly to witnesses than to teachers. And if he does listen to teachers, it is because they are witnesses. From the Apostolic Exhortation Evangelii Nunziandi, 1975. With joy, I present my congratulations to the two bishops who celebrate today the 30th anniversary of priestly ordination, His, His Grace Paul Semogrere, Metropolitan Archbishop of Kampala, and His Lordship Christopher Kakosa, Bishop of Lugazi. Finally, I would like to congratulate and to thank the Diocese of Jinja and, and the many institutions and individuals for their contributions for a successful celebration of this Blessing Day. Happy Martyrs Day to all. May I now invite the Prime Minister from the Owachaba Zinga Wabusoga to come and invite or welcome His Royal Highness the Chaba Zinga Wabusoga to come and address the congregation. Welcome Dr. Joseph Movawala Nsekere. Uh, Njako soli miorusoga, okwandula chaba zinga wabusoga, lata chaba zinga, gaula na diopo okuna tusanga ilo kubona, omulimo guange muangu nzilabu yinzabu ogerela kuno, okutu olaku baba okusaba, ogane, ove kumuntebe yao, osembele kuwano wendi, baba olamuseku abantubo.
Right Honorable Robin Anabanja, who is representing the President, Your Excellency Edward Sekandi, Vice President Emeritus, Your Excellency the Apostolic Nuncio to Uganda, Mama Maria Nyerere, Your Grace the Bishops of Kampala, Gulu, Tororo, and Barara, plus other various areas, your Lord, the bishops, in your various capacities, the lead of opposition in parliament, honorable ministers from the central government present, patron of this year's celebrations, honorable Justin Kasule Lumumba, our prime minister, and your deputy from Busoga Kingdom, all priests, religious leaders, and political leaders here present, all people of God and pilgrims here present, I convey warm regards from the loving people of Busoga Kingdom. Abasoga Naba and Ibona Bona, Sanga Irokuba Bona, Mweba de Kuidamu Wunjimuti. I'm delighted to be among the faithfuls who are celebrating this year's Matters Day here at Namugongo. I commend the Catholic Church for upholding the spiritual values that our matters cherished. As the people of Busoga, we cherish the sacrifices made by the original 45 matters, who included, but not limited to, Matia Mulumba from Mayuge and Gonza Gagonza from Kaliro. As a cultural institution, we shall safeguard what the matters stood for, such that thy endeavors don't die in vain. It explains why every year the kingdom rallies believers to pay homage to Cheva and <laughs> Kamera mukube babe chifana nyinga bali mu echira bakuba ifetwe na twena abategeike Mama na bale we bale ino we bali le ilala Olwanga wo kufa wasigalango tuwe bida be binji bityo Adabu ofanga mama otajia kusigala muita ka ostukiranga ga igulu singani no buyinza we byandi baile aye nzira buyinzo wo Ah batuga ile but father, we did not move from Ungaro. But we are here to serve you. But we are here to serve you. But we are here to serve you. 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 We are Oweshi ti, wechia gai guluino his excellency ori kaguta mseveni. Yatu gemera kukumu kologuno, obu umbi bubiri, obu esente. <laughs> Era anti nendo bategeza haba soga. Ngachi ya paso ni wa finance committee. Tuline mpi yedijia no kusigala wo. Tuire, tui, bishop wa sale wo chediba dikole. Mkwe kula kulani ya mda sisi ya ifeye busoga. Mumoku vile mongalo. Nendo kwe baza Owe chiti ibuwa Omubi uka wa president Mugala wa imwe Alupo Jessica Epere Rose Yatu wabuka ire chikumi Esente mumpeke Momo kubile mungalo Nendo kwe baza Owe chiti ibuwa Speaker wa Uganda Anita Among Anet Yatu wabuka ire makumiana Age senti Chibumba ba ire mulungi yetu the God has been good to us. The Uganda matters have performed miracles. We got much more than we had budgeted for. God is good. Prime Minister wa Uganda wa Chitibwa, Dada wa Ife, Robin Anabanja, ya tugemera kuyatua obukaire ikumi, ya komandinga wa security baide bakole emirimo, 
ya commanding aba national water babega no ya commanding aba masana lazo obutavaku ya koba baide babega no sawa binera babaide ni fetu mukubire mungalo baba nenda kwe bazabuli yavayo ya tugemera ku aba tuwaira amagezi we want to thank all of those who have contributed in terms of finances in terms of advising us, most importantly, the parish priest of this place, Father Vicent. Father Vicent Lubega. Let's clap for Father Vicent. Father, to ever say no, or to have a day, wherever they know. In a special way, I want to thank the chairman of the organizing committee, Mr. Balida Ine Paulo. Thank you so much. I want to thank all of the chairpersons of committees and committees. In a special way, in a special way, I want to thank the choir. You put in eight months, that is not easy. Oyo musengu wa gwetu saka, haba sasule mche musingo kuenda. Haba kari haba tabaga malongo. Haba kuruoti ni ifaba idu kurubazale malongo. Atene ndo kwe bazaba na baife aba chinie Aba na baife aba chinie mwe bale ino mwe bale ili idala Tuidanga aba soga As proud iba soga When the Uganda matters were there We are also represented as iba soga And we pledge as lay people To continue Carrying forward the Catholic faith Making people understand Catholicism Wherever we are when, even where we are in politics. I want in a special way to take this opportunity to invite the right Honorable Robin Anabanja, the Prime Minister of the Republic of Uganda, who is here to represent His Excellency Ori Kagutam Seven. Bana Mwanir Zedada Waife. Mwanir Zedada Waife na Chikiride His Excellency Ori Kagutam Seven. Tusanga ile ino dada Kwaya Kwaya ya kwaya Mwene aka sangala No mgeni yena sangala 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 No mgeni yena sangala 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 No mgeni yena sangala Kwa sima sima No mgeni yena sima Kwa sima sima No mgeni yena sima Akwaya tutewa na kandi tulagi Aha, mukube munga, mukube munga, lo dada tu se, dada, dada, dada wange, o musoka kubati, kuna yatu wa, kwaya, kwaya, kuna yatu wa, kwaya, 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 kuna yatu wa, thank you so much kwaya, kwaya, dada tu se. Thank you so much. The main celebrant. The Bishop of Ginger Diocese. Charles Martin. The Apostolic Nonso. The Chava Zinga. Of Busoga, Mama Nyerere, Maria, the First Lady Emeritus of Tanzania, the Vice President Emeritus, His Excellency Edward II, the Leader of Opposition in the Parliament, 
the honorable ministers, the prime minister of Busoga, and the other cultural leaders, honorable members of parliament, other religious leaders, fellow pilgrims, ladies and gentlemen, like you have already been told, I'm here to represent the president of the Republic of Uganda. I bring you greetings from His Excellency the President of the Republic of Uganda, Yoweri Kaguta Museven. He was unable to come because you know where he is, and therefore he sent me to represent him here. And I have come with his speech, which I will read verbatim. But before that, my sister forgot to introduce the ministers present. Allow me to introduce them so that you know they are here. We have the Honorable Tom Butime, the Minister of Tourism. He's present. Yes, he's here. And you know his contribution to this function. We have Honorable Mary Mugasa, the Minister of State Public Service. She's there. She's a very strong Catholic from Hoima Diocese. We have Honorable Peace Mutuzo, the Minister of State Gender. They are up there. So let me now go to the speech of the President. I join the pilgrims and all believers who have converged today at Namugongo to honor the sacrifice and the face of the Uganda martyrs. Every 3rd of June, thousands of pilgrims gather in Namugongo to celebrate the courage of the Uganda martyrs, whose faith was not shaken by Kabaka Mwanga's prosecution of Christians. It is on account of their courageous example that the seed of Christianity was firmly planted in Uganda and beyond. I extend a warm welcome to the pilgrims who have traveled from outside the country to observe the Uganda Matters Day with their Ugandan brothers and sisters. I wish you a peaceful and happy stay in Uganda. I want to register my regret concerning the incident of reckless driving at Kamuli roundabout, which inflicted injuries on, to some of the Balamazi from Busowa, Catholic Paris, Bugiri district. I wish those in the hospital quick recovery and caution motorists and border border riders to drive carefully and respect the Balamazi and the other pedestrians on road. It is wonderful to see several groups of pilgrims trekking to Namugongo from all parts of Uganda and beyond. This holy pilgrimage is possible on account of the prevailing conditions of peace and stability in Uganda. Peace and stability are important because they create an atmosphere where people can freely exercise their rights and pursue their legitimate interests. It is written in Matthew chapter 5, verse 9, Blessed are those peacemakers, for they will be called children of God. Uganda is reaping peace dividends in the form of rapid economic growth and development. That is the tarmac roads, electricity, schools, hospitals, etc. However, in order for the development to be meaningful, it must be translated into jobs and wealth for households. For instance, a good tarmac road becomes meaningful to a household if we use it to transport farm produce. For example, crops, milk, 
ETC to the market. The road is a public good. It belongs to everyone. However, the incomes generated from the sale of your farm produce belongs to the individual or family. Therefore, it is important for all households to join the waste creation campaign in order to guarantee prosperity. The NRM government is mobilizing the remaining 39% of the Ugandan households that are still trapped in subsistence farming that is working only for, the, for food to join the money economy. Subsistence farming fosters poverty because besides the food, there are other human needs that must be satisfied, such as shelter, medicine, clothes, education, transport, etc. This can only be obtained with money. You, can, you cannot maintain a status of moneyless in a modern economy. The Paris development model and the wealth funds are aimed at increasing the number of wealth creators engaged in production in the four sectors of commercial agriculture, industries, services, and iced city. I appeal to all believers to work hard and embrace the ongoing wealth creation campaign by government. It is about liberating everyone from the oppression of poverty and social backwardness. God commanded the man to tame the earth for his own benefit and survival. The Bible says as follows in Genesis chapter 1 verse 28. God said unto them, be fruitful and multiply and replenish the earth and subdue it and have dominion over the fish of the sea and over the fall of the air and over every living that moves upon the earth. The above scripture shows that man was mandated to be a master of his environment by understanding and utilizing the laws of nature to serve his interests. For example, we get food from soil. We get medicine from plants, etc. This is what is meant by establishing dominion over nature. Therefore, in order to qualify as good stewards of the earth, everyone must play their role in taming nature to produce a good or a service that society needs. Finally, I want to salute all pilgrims that have participated in the commemoration of Uganda Matters Day. The spirit of sacrifice and self-denial is important in propelling individual and national development. I urge all the people of Uganda to emulate the spirit of sacrifice from Uganda Matters to keep our country on the path to stability, prosperity, and godliness. He gave a contribution of two billion Uganda ceilings. I thank you all for God and my country, Yoweri Kaguta Museven, President of the Republic of Uganda. I want to hand over his speech to the Bishop of Jinja Diocese. I also, you know, I had contributed 10 million. I have come with 10 million as an addition.
Thank you so much, Right Honorable. And I request that before you go, we're going to have a photo. You're going to have a photo with the bishops. May I request all the bishops to move near there where the Messi bird is, that we may have a group photo, a historic group photo in memory of this day. Tazreen. We shall request the first photograph is the main celebrant. Then we shall request all the archbishops and bishops uh, to come and join the guest of honor for the memorial photograph of this pilgrimage. May I now request your graces and my lord bishops to join the photograph. May I invite all the uh, Xeverians who have the umbrellas to come and uh, join the bishops as we have the recess hymn. Okay, thank you very much, Right Honorable Prime Minister, the main celebrant and all the members of the Uganda Episcopal Conference. Unfortunately, due to the rain on the steps, we are unable to have all the other perseverance to join in the photograph. And all the fathers from Ginger, you've been requested to report to the Basilica for some important information. All the priests from Ginger Diocese. Members of the congregation, we shall note that we have essentially ended mass because it had the recession song. So the servers, please, let's have, let's have the recession hymn. Once again, on behalf of the masters of ceremony, uh, Father Ben, Hugh and myself, Professor Vincent Bagire, we thank you so much for having been a good congregation, for following the program, and all the great things that God has given us today. Thank you, Professor Rajiv. One, 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 one. Yes, uh, ladies and gentlemen, to be Masino Kuanga, Mutulaba, and up to Govera, Tragalo Kueva, Samuena, Ababa Deco, Namgezako Kuanga, Mutu Govera, uh, Ugandan Catholic Online, Onako Ruale, Ronga Tuluan, Kuchigua, Chaba Julizi, and Namugongo, Gatuja Guza, Eranga Tutu Kiraba Jajafe, Abat Firira, Bajajafe, Abaluan, Dinian of Wanga, Everawa. Atuaga lo kuwe ranga tuwe basamu na 
Olunako lwalero obo mwaka guno gukulembedwa esaza bye jinja a uh, jinja de that's the soft ginger ye kulembedemu ero musumba Charles Martin Wamika olwana ko lwalero ya kulembedemu a uh, esaza lye atenga bakulembera mu kuberanga abageza ko kubanga atujja guza wano kubikwa ina mugongo ebya bajulizi abajulizi abakatuliki abafiye dini yo bu kristu abutelefu nyo okuberanga kitukitambira dalala bulunyi nyo twagala okuberanga tubeba za mwenna aje musinzi dokuberanga mutulaba atubeba za bapata na bafe betutambude nabo a okuvira dalala wetata ndiko kubanga tugena mudayo sisezenja ulo a zonanga tutambula katuba wa mauli akakwategala kubala amazinga bwe bali batambula okutusolona ku lwalero lwetujaguza twagala kwebaza St Francis Bogio St Francis School Bogio twagala kwebaza St Cyprian Chabakade twagala kwebaza banafa ba St Francis Nagalama twagala kwebaza banafa ba St Ibali Kudembe SS Kisoga twagala kwebaza abanafe aba Nagalama Junior a primary school nabo uterevu nyo tubadde nabo twagala ate okwebaza abanafe aba mitiana nursing and midwifery a school twagala kwebaza banafe abamitiana agrovet nabo tugeza masono kuberanga tubera nabo abutelevu nyo eyo sound bo ulira oba ebivuga namalowozi byo ulira yeyo kwaya e tukulembede onako lwalero eya jinja diocese bakubide dalo ebivuga ebye kinansi omuli adungu omuli ebivuga byechi su